is the answer to Forest left back problems already at the club. Before we get into the video, if you'd like to drop a like on it and also subscribe, I'm nearly at a thousand subscribers and it'll mean a lot if I get there before the season. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So Forrest signed three left backs last year, uh, two permanently and one on loan. The first man through the door was Omar Richards. The second man was Harry Toffolo. And then the third was Renan Lodi on loan from Atletico Madrid. Now you think obviously with the, with a big overhaul Forrest had last year, you'd like to think you'd want two players in each position. So why go and sign three left backs? Well, Forrest's first left back signing, Omar Richards, joined the club for I think about 10 million pounds with add-ons and everything from Bayern Munich. It looked a real good deal. Um, he was coming back from winning a few titles in Germany. Obviously, he'd been at Reading before that. And you think maybe he's going to be our starting left back with Toffolo as our cover. But then he passes his medical and everything goes fine. And then you don't see him in any of the pre-season pictures. He's not playing in any of the games. And questions are starting to be asked of, of, of Cooper and the club. It turns out when he did his medical, the doctors actually missed a hairline fracture in his leg that ruled him out for a few months to get obviously operated on and everything. So then that's when Forrest made the decision to go and go and get Renan Lodi on loan. We had a view to an option to buy, which is 25 million, I think 26 million euros, uh, something like that. And then Lodi played the whole season with obviously Toffolo, Toffolo making a few appearances off the bench. And he did start a few games as well, Toffolo did. But then at the end of the season, it did look like Forrest was going to pursue Renan Lodi permanently. And this all comes after uh, Omar Richards wasn't named in the 25 or 26 man squad in January. And Cooper did come out and say he really needs time to, to build himself back up from that big injury. And he also had a setback with that injury. So it's better off just leaving him for the rest of the season and he'll come back next year. Now, a lot's been made over the last few weeks of who Forrest should go and get a left back. Should Forrest go and get Loddy permanently? Should they go and get Augusto, who's been linked? Uh, a few have been, a few different ones have been linked as well. But the thing is, is that we've just gone and spent £10 million on a man who obviously didn't start every single game for Bayern Munich, but he was still part of their squad in Omar Richards. And he had a hell of a, a year or two at Reading when he was playing his best football, obviously, before he, he got brought by Bayern Munich. And when Forrest signed him last year, I did think it would be a real, really good deal. And I think fans are forgetting how good he can be. Obviously, we've not seen him personally, so I can't really judge him on that. I can only judge him from when I've watched him at Reading. And obviously, if you go and get brought by Bayern Munich, you've got to be half a half-decent player. Um, so I think Forrest needs to stop worrying about the left-back position and just get Omar Richards fit because if he can turn around his fitness and keep himself fit again and not injured, then that's like a new signing for us because we've not seen him yet. And we don't have to go and spend 25 million on Lodi or however much Atletico won or go and sign a new left-back and go for all that rigmarole. We could just keep Omar Richards and play him because that's what he was brought for. So I do think the answer to Forrest's left-back question and problem is already at the club in Omar Richards. And I do think if he becomes fit, has a good pre-season under his belt and just hits the ground running, he can be a very, very important player for us. Let me know in the comments down below what you think we should do with Omar Richards. And um, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a strange one. Obviously what happened to him last season, but I do think he's going to be a part of this, this season coming up. But yeah, drop a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't. And until next time, See ya.